Yesterday's Apple event was comforting. For an hour and a half, Tim Cook and others sued me. They introduced the best iPhone ever and gave me a brief respite from this hell world. That feeling called until last though. On one hand, due to my crippling anxiety, and the other because I get paid to write about companies like Apple. So, when I rolled out of bed this morning I began digging. And something made me double take, Apple stopped selling its iPhone 11 Pro models on its site. Where have you gone? Yep, if you go on Apple's website you can no longer purchase last year's top models, instead you have to buy the iPhone 12 Pro range instead. This is pretty weird, especially because the iPhone 11 Pro models are fantastic phones that'll still be relevant for years to come. Why has Apple stopped selling the iPhone 11 Pro models? I think it is about two connected things, supply chain and modeling its phone range. The first one we can brush past quickly. The more different phones Apple sells, the more complex manufacturing and shipping them becomes. Discontinuing the iPhone 11 Pro nips that in the bud. This doesn't adequately answer why the company would get rid of some of its best phones so quickly. And, to understand that, we need to look closer at yesterday Essen. You can read full post on Cryptophones. News, link available in text below.